Hey, welcome to Moo Moo Math and another math trick on multiplying two digit numbers. Let's go ahead and jump right in. Let's see if we have to multiply 44 times 32. This technique takes advantages of uh, multiplying numbers that end in zero and um, then you can easily add this up. So uh, let me give you one example and you can uh, then we can talk about it. The first step is you take 40 times 30. So we have 40 times 30 which equals 1200. Then what we do, the next step is we take 40 times 2 which is 80 and then from 40 plus 2 the next thing we then do is take 4 times 30 which is 120 and then finally we go 4 times 2 which is 8 we then can add these up 80 plus 120 is 200 200 plus 1200 and as you can see with all the zeros it makes uh, the addition pretty easy that's 1400 plus 8 so the answer is 1408 again it's taking advantage of the 100s and then it makes some numbers easy to add together let's look at another example we have 24 times 46 first thing we do is we take 20 times 40 and that will equal 800 and then next is 20 times 6 which is 120 so that's 20 times 6 and then we move to this digit 4 then it will be 4 times 40 which is 160 and then 4 times 6 which is 24 then we can easily add this together so we have 800 plus 120 is 920 and then 920 plus 160 uh, will equal 1080 and then 1080 plus 24 will equal to 1104. So again, you'll see that the multiplication in an example like this is pretty easy. Let me go with go one ahead and look at the last example. That's 36 times 24. Remember, we're trying to take advantage of the zeros. So we have 30 times 20, which is equal to 600. And then we have 30 times 4 for 812 which is 120 then we move to the second digit 6 times 20 is 120 also and then 6 times 4 is 24 we then total these up in any fashion that we think is the easiest I personally will go 600 plus 7 I'm gonna total these two first 120 and 120 is 240 240 and 600 is 840 and again you can see how the multiplication is really pretty easy because you have so many zeros then we go 24 and that will be 864 so our total our answer for 36 times 24 is 864 uh, with a little bit of practice you actually can uh, begin to do these in your head they're quick and um, if you're in a situation where you don't have a calculator or maybe taking a standardized test and you just don't want to get the calculator out, uh, this can really speed it up and be helpful. Hope this was helpful. And there will be a link down below for, uh, I have a link to my website that has uh, several more math tricks and shortcuts.